Hello and welcome to this tutorial. I'm going to show you today how to use Google's Geolock uh, API to find an address on geolocation. So I'll quickly create a new application which will have one page and a button and a text box. The text box, whatever has been written in the text box, it will be read and it will be taken as an address and the map will be, the Google map will be showing the address on the, on the Google, on the map actually. It will, uh, will be zoomed in to the Google map. Let's see now. Uh, I'll give it a name, find location, so this is the name of my application. Okay, once then I see this page, these are the project settings, I can do my uh, theme changes, theme selection, and I'm selecting now pastel for this page, and I can open my start screen this is my first page this is how it will look like and I can click on this gear button and rename my page to find location this should be without spaces because this page is not shown to the user click on the caption and you can change the swatch up actually this is a theme okay so I'll give it a find Address. Does it need to have the back button? Now, quickly, I'll create an input screen over here, an input widget over here, and I'll give it uh, enter address to search or to find whatever sounds easier. And then there could be a button. I'll just drag this widget also and place here. Make sure it's in line and to have find. I'll, I'll I've got loads of icons to choose from. Let's choose this one maybe. And then um can have different based on my theme. Okay, now this is done. I a button, let me give it a name, find button or BTN is my convention. This is a text box, I'll give it a name address txt and now I'm gonna drag and drop the map and I'll give it my map okay this is the name and I'll set the default location to Dubai and show marker if it's clicked we can see the marker on the map okay so my interface is pretty much ready I just need to now create the inter create the service and then hook this up with the server with the interface. So now I'll create the service. This is the geofording service and the GPS it, which actually enables the, ge the geolocation. So I need to copy a URL but because this is working on JavaScript. Uh, this is the JSON is the library we are using. Google is actually using. So I'll just give it a name, um, find location service, leave the rest as default, and now a new service will be created, and we are supposed to fill up this information, I'll copy and paste uh, the link over here, and we're using the get method, we can use the other method also, like put or post, whatever, and then once this is finished, from settings, we'll directly go to request. From request, I need I need to see the the API. What exactly this this API does, and what are the required parameters for it to execute. So there is only one essential parameter, which is address. All the other ones are optional. So I write address here, and there's no value. The value will be the text which the user writes in the text box, and we'll populate it over here. So my settings finished, my request is finished. I'll just leave it to one variable. And then the response I need to fill up. I can do this manually, but I'd like to, to test the first the application first by writing a location, for example, of the body. When I test, when I get the results, you'll see the Abu Dhabi is found on the map. It's in the UAE, the, the GPS coordinates, latitude and longitude is also mentioned. Okay, good. So the service is working, and now notice I 
using this service I can actually fill up all this whatever is, requ is required in the response so I'll do import as response and all the response fields will be filled up automatically okay so now this is done my test is successful now the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hook this service with this page so right now I've been in the design view I'll go to the data view I'll create new service uh, for this page and I'll use the existing one I've got only one find location service I'll do add and give it a name um, address locate address because it is doing the lookup and the mapping before sending I need to ensure the text from the text box is going to the address that's all so this is the address txt widget I created and its text should go to the address of the service that's all I'll do save it and return and once this is successful once this is successful do expand all to the uh, let me do this again once this is successful go to mapping again expand all on both sides then make sure you read the read the latitude and lo longitude readings into the interfaces map so the locations latitude is here it should go to the interfaces map and longitude should go to the it should go to the longitude and we can also have the marker point out exactly where it is so we do the same for the marker and return and solve okay so we are we're done with this uh, now the next thing I need to do is I need to add JavaScript over here so what what happens is when this locate address service is uh, successful I need to refresh the map that's what I need to do so I do run script run javascript er um, map is equal to appray and i need to write the name of the map here i think it was let's see what is the name of the map the name of my map was my map okay let's go to, back to the design and edit this my map and now we'll set it to the location map.options. So the address is the only field over here is equal to we'll give it empty because we are reading the address from the um, from the API from the response actually. So that's all map dot refresh now this should not come. Yeah, okay, so I need to change the uh, the brackets. You need to use the square bracket. So I'll be using the square brackets instead. So this should hopefully get rid of this problem. And just simply do save. So not, what I'm doing is, before sending, I'm, I'm making sure that <clears throat> the text that the user has um, entered in the text box goes to the the services request parameter this is how I'm doing this once this is done um, after it is successful I'm storing the location from the map which has found the exact latitude and log longitude of the address that I attempted to find I'm storing its longitude and lo latitude values inside my maps longitude and latitude values and the marker values and then I'll do a refresh. How am I doing the refresh? Through the through this J JavaScript. <clears throat> okay. So the next thing I need to do is to hook up this buttons event with the service. So if this button find button is clicked, the event is clicked, then invoke a service. Which service? I have only one service. Locate address. Save. And that should be pretty much it. So now the next thing I should do is to um launch it to test it okay so right right on address here to find dubai is a default location because we selected 
the default location over here for the map Dubai let's find write an address and find out okay so here we go right, Abu Dhabi Abu Dhabi is there the rest let's write Ras Al Khaimah and it should reach Ras Al Khaimah hooray yay so we've got this so now let's write higher College of Technology Ras Al Khaimah and let's search this okay we are here now let's just zoom in where exactly we are yes that's right this is where we are how about double js okay so there we are we have found double js finally okay so i hope you enjoyed uh, i advise you guys to do this exercise yourself at home and i'll see you next class thank you okay.